So did you know that when you first launch a brand new product on Amazon, Amazon throws you all the weight in the back of the searches. And in order for you to rank, you need sales because 80% of sales occur among the top 10 sellers on page number one. So I know you might be left with a question, which is an important question. How do I rank if I need sales, but I can't generate sales because Amazon has me all the way in the back of the searches? Well, that's exactly what I'm going to share with you guys in this video. And I'm also going to share with you how you can do it actually in, in less than uh, 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 you know, a week. Uh, now, this, if this is your first time, please consider subscribing. Also, smash thumbs up button because it helps us in the algorithm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually share with you guys my screen, and I'm going to go into step-by-step -step on how to exactly do that. And I'll share with you guys some resources, which I'll link below in the description. So the very first thing that's very important that I want to share with you guys is that I found a product, right? So this product is something that we've sold in the past. Um, we sold it for about a year, year and a half and did very well for a little bit, but then we ended up liquidating it just because the competition got a little bit too much and everybody was racing down to the bottom. So this is a product called Bread Lane. Now what this product does is for bakers, um, you could actually make shapes on the bread, right? So we had a bundle, I think we sold it with like, uh, like sheet pan, we sold it with a couple of things. And it did very well for, for, again, for a pretty decent period of time, about 12 to 18 months, right? So when you come to launching this product, one thing to understand is, again, if you want to succeed, you need to make sales and you get your product to rank among the top 10 sellers. Now, if we're going to analyze this product um, to see if it's viable or not, which is not the topic of this video, but let's just go ahead and do that. So what I'd like to do is I like to take out the sponsored ones because simply... You know, they change and I don't want them to impact my searches. So you're going to see that, you know, top, top sellers, they make pretty decent amount of money, especially the top three, right? Now, one thing is, all right, well, if these guys make all the money, if I scroll down, you see how like sales drop and then you've got other, other ones that are doing really well, but that's not because they're ranking for this keyword. So Amazon, just like any other, just like Google, just like YouTube, it's a search engine, right? People come to Amazon searching for certain things. So it's all about keyword search, right? So cool thing is that there is a tool called Helium 10, which has a tool called Magnet. And I'll also link in the description a 50% uh, off coupon for you to get Helium 10. So if you go to Helium 10 and go to Magnet, what you can do is you can search by keyword and then Helium 10 will suggest to you this thing called CPR. And CPR stands for let me see, let me see, let me see. I don't know. I think it's called, what is it? Um, I forgot what it was called, to be honest with you. All right, well, besides the point, whatever it's called. Um, but this number, is, and if you can see, it says estimated number of units that need to be sold over eight days, resulting from a search for this keyword in order for the product to rank on top half of the page for this keyword, right? So what is telling you that for this keyword, uh, what is it? Br brought brought form bread rate rising baskets. You need to give away eight units over an eight day period for you to rank, right? So that's super awesome because what giveaways do. And well, let me let me back up a little bit and talk about giveaways. So what giveaways are? They are pretty much artificial sales. You are showing Amazon that hey, look, Amazon, I am making sales. Therefore, I would like you to rank me at the top of the page for this keyword, right? Because Amazon is all about keyword searches. So the very first thing they have to do is, number one, you need to find a keyword that's relevant to your product, which you want Amazon to rank you for. That's the very first thing. Number two, you want to decide how many units that you need to give away for this keyword under using this keyword in order for you to rank, right? So the first thing is choosing the keyword. How do you choose a keyword? Well, first of all, it needs to be relevant to your product and it should be, write this down, it should be, it should have between 2,000 to 7,000 monthly search volume, right? So this is right here, monthly search volume. 8,000 is good, right? 8,000 is good, 8,700, that's still okay, right? It's got CPR of 47 units. That means over an eight day period, you need to give away 47 units per day. So if we divide 48, 47 divided by eight, so on average, about five and a half, almost six units per day in order for you to rank. Now, this is not, you know, like 100%, you know, it could be 40, it could be 50, it doesn't matter, right? So let's say if you just want to give away five units, five times, 
uh, eight. So you could give away 40 units <clears throat> and still be able to rank, right? Now, what I usually like to do is when I first rank a product, write this down, I like to find two keywords that have between 2,000 to 7,000 monthly search volume. And then I like to rank my product for those two keywords, right? So what I'll do is I'll simply find people that will buy, that will go to Amazon. So what they'll do is they'll go to Amazon and then they'll search my product. So let's say for instance, one keyword is bread lane, right? So bread lane. So I'll type bread lane and then I'll go find my product. I'll click on it and then I'll buy it. So that way it looks to Amazon like it's a organic search. You don't want to just send them a link to your product, right? Now, it depends on who these people are. They might be just your friends and cousins that just want to support you. Maybe they need a product. Otherwise, you just refund them the amount via PayPal or Zelle or Venmo or whatever other tools you have. Now, you might be asking, well, Bashar, I don't know if I can find 40 people. And that's one keyword, right? Well, if you're going to go for a keyword that's got 8,000 monthly searches, I would say focus on just this one keyword. Otherwise, if you're going to go for a keyword that's got, let's say, two, three, four thousand monthly searches, then it'll be more like 20, uh, 20 search volume, right? Or 20 CPR, 20 units they need to give away per eight day period. So, if, and then the cool thing about Magnet, what it does, it gives you, it suggests to you other products that are related to your product. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sort by search volume. And then see, these have too much search volume. I'm going to just pass on them. And then I'm going to go here, right? So, bread. Okay, baking gadgets, bowl scraper, bread making kit. So that could be one. Sourdough bread, baking supplies, and a tool case, sourdough proofing basket. So you're not a sell. All these are related to the product, but they're not the actual product, right? They're other related products. So bread cutter. Okay, so this would be it. What I would do is I would search this keyword on Amazon and make sure that my product shows up. Okay, so it's, see, it's a different product. And that's why this doesn't make sense because it's a completely different product than a bread lane. So this would have worked. Proofing box, Bray Baker, box knife, bread bowl, proofing basket, Danish whisk, bread warmer, baking gift, uh, bacon set, breaking proofing box, scoring tool. It says scoring tool. I think this might be also similar. <clears throat> okay, so this is a little different. Well, I think it does a similar job, no? I want to say it does a similar job. What's scoring? I don't know what scoring means. So you might need to understand what that is. Wooden making tool, tool storage box, artisan, linen bread bags, razor, blade, knife. Okay. But this is a little broad. It's not, yeah, see, it's not. See, that's very important is you want to search that product, that keyword on Amazon, make sure whatever it is that you're searching for is actually showing up, right? Lane bread tool. Okay, there we go. So it's just spelled differently, right? <clears throat> okay, so this is a great keyword that's got 2,000 lane bread tool, um, 2,500 monthly search volume, and it's only 30, right? So if you divide 30, um, if you divide 30 by eight, then that's, you know, three and a half units. So let's say just four units times eight, so 32 units, right? So maybe you could do something like this. And then another one that's like around the same uh, search volume, or you could just do the bread lane, which has 47 units, or you could do both. Depends on your risk tolerance, depends on your budget, depends on how many units you've ordered, right? You obviously want to order at least 300 units uh, because, you know, 50 of them are going to go for a giveaway. But the, what, what, one thing you got to understand is all that money is coming back to you, you know, because someone is paying you and then you're paying them. So this money is coming back to you, right? <clears throat> Now, if you're like, but Bashar, that sounds great. Okay, so now I know how to search for keywords. I know how many search volume. I know how many units I need to give away. But the one other issue, you know, and then I, I don't have Helium 10, but I'm going to use your discount code, which is in the description, to go and get it. But then what if I don't have 30 people? I don't have 40 people. Well, I've got a solution for you. But if you're watching so far, you're enjoying the content. And you want us to walk you through this entire process because it looks interesting for you. You've been following us for a while. You've been following Amazon FBA for a while. You really want to get involved. You really want to know how to do this, but you're afraid that you might make mistakes. And trust me, when I tell you I've lost tens of thousands of dollars on mistakes and you don't want to do that because at some point you will run out of trial and error. Below this video, there is a link that'll take you to a short case study that'll walk you through how BJK University can help you and how you can get involved. 
So if you'd like us to help you, click the link below this video. So with that said, there is this company called Intellerank, which we use that help us with giveaways. So you simply reach out to Intellerank, and by the way, just say that I am a BJK University. Uh, uh, obviously, you're not a student, so you can't say you're a student, but just say I was sent by BJK University, because if you do say that, they will give you a discount. Uh, they, you know, they won't say, oh, well, it's $80 for you, it'll be $70. They'll just give you the, the $70 without telling you how much the actual price is, but they'll give you a discount, so make sure that you mention that. And we also get a small kickback. Um, so until the rank, what they do is you reach out to them and you say, hey, this is my product. This is my keyword or keywords. Let's say you've got two. And I want to give away X amount of units. Now, if the amount of units is too much or too little, they will tell you, hey, we suggest that you do this many units. And then it's obviously up to you because you are the business owner. But now you've automated the entire thing, right? So you reach out to them and then they have people all around the world that will buy your product consistently. They will take, let's say, if you're going to give away 40 units, they will divide that, uh, divide that by four, uh, by, I'm sorry, so 42 units, I think we said, divide that by eight. So that's five units or so roughly per day. They've got people that will consistently find your product, go to Amazon, search the keyword that you're trying to rank under, buy your product, make it look like a organic search. And then you actually pay until it ring directly and then they refund the people themselves. So you don't have to deal with it. It's completely, it's completely scalable. It's completely uh, automated. Every single product we've launched in the last two years, we've used until the rank. Every single product our students have launched in the last you know, two years, they have used until the rank. It's a great service. We've used it. I'll link their information below as well for you to get a discount. Um, but outside of that, really just kind of a, a, a few things that you should, you know, you should watch out for when launching a product. Number one, you need to understand that in order for you to rank, you need sales because Amazon throws you all the way in the back of the searches and 80% of sales occur among the top 10 sellers. Giveaways, what they do is they create artificial sales to make it look like to Amazon that you are making sales and then so that you can rank. And for you to do that, you need to find one or two keywords that have between 2,000 to 7,000 monthly search volume you could either have people buy it, don't send them a link, send them the keyword, say, hey, this is my listing, go to Amazon, search the keyword, find my product, buy it that way, and then you can refund them. Or if they just want to support you, that's cool. Or you can find IntelliRank, and I'll, uh, I'll link both the links to um, IntelliRank and to Helium 10 below this video. Now, I've got other videos. Now, this is not it about when it comes to launches. I've got other videos in the channel that talk to you about launches and other things that you should look out for, like reviews. Um, like doing PPC campaigns and all that. And I have other videos that explain all that. But if you want BJK University to walk you through all that, literally just lay the groundwork for you, give you a blueprint, just say, do this, next, do this, next, do that. Have someone there for you to answer your questions. Have a community of successful sellers that will be there for you to motivate you, to help you crush it. Check out the link below this video where it's a short presentation. We'll walk you through all that. Until then, hope to see you in the next video. Take care.